Ah, oh, you missed. Oh, come here. I'll throw you in there. I actually heard a rumor that if you throw vampires down there in the vortex, they will never ever respawn. But I guess that's the, the, the vampire behind me is the only one we can do this with, so... I don't know. Why we have to go is this way. Now if you don't have the power to flight, uh, the power to swim, you take constant damage while going up this path. And then you're gonna die anyway when going down here. I don't know if you can go through this place without having, without having the power to swim. But anyway, you should have it. What's that? That's an odd-looking wall with lights somewhere, somehow. I gotta be careful the humans around, like this one. The arrow shooters are the most annoying because they can hit you from a very great distance. I don't actually know. I don't actually want soul now, whatever. And you can actually kill them, kill them, kill them. Blah blah blah, kill them quite easily by just shooting like that. Because you don't need to stun them and then fatality move them. You can just shoot them and then they're dead. But if you have a throwing weapon, just throw it at them even if they have already noticed you. Now, this is the main gate, but why should they let a vampire in? I mean, even an undead vampire. What you have to do is. Oh, yeah, also, this place is 100% optional. You never ever need to go to this place. But we should actually think we can go through this, go to this place without having power to swim. Because I think we can get up here by in the spectral realm. Hmm, whatever. All you have to do is go to some other place. That was a flamethrower. You have to be really careful. It can mow down your HP. Basically, just um, take cover, cover, and then shoot him from afar. Now I think we actually need to stack them. So let's just do that right ahead because we can, if it's wrong, we can still move two blocks on top of, on top of each other. And actually we, yeah, yeah, I think we really have to um, go down, thank you. Uh, which way? This one? No, over here. There we go. It's even a weapon. I don't know why. I don't know why they should play, play the weapon in a place like that. And be careful of that. I just killed him. Uh, if you just rush through there, don't kill him and get up there. This actually starts a cutscene and I can see your dude attacking you from behind. It's towering, towering walls and deep moats engineered to keep Nosgoth's vampire plague at bay. There we go. Built to be a stronghold against vampires. But we're not vampires, we're undead vampires. Though the city was well fortified against vampires. Its human architects hadn't considered a breach by a creature such as myself. Well, I guess it's time to do some evil stuff. Killing humans over and over. <laughs> yeah. There's a puzzle in this area. It's quite a big area, actually. Quite some puzzles and stuff. And this was actually just a civilian, but he was standing in my way. Such, such as this one. It actually. Come on, stop running away and die. Die like a man. There you go. Also, you should look out for climbable walls all over the place because then sometimes they're not that easy to see. But in this case, it gives you nothing actually. You can't get up there, so it just gives you a bit of cliff power. They shouldn't really need cliff power for this place. Sorry, guys. I was just. I thought you were an enemy. <laughs> you can actually climb this area. Yeah. I don't think there's anything significant up there. Maybe you can. I don't know. We need to find your own way through this place. This is like the main area. Hey, you, you there, miss. Well, oh, she's gone. I didn't mean to do that, but somehow I hit him. Hmm, whatever. This lap pipe need weapon. 
think that it was actually like a monk fighter, I think. I don't know, I think there's like some fighters around here. No, I can't think I can get up there. Can, you can also take a swim down there. And you should really only go to this place if you can already swim because if you can you can do some more stuff in here. I think. What's that? Nothing. I thought there was something there. I think we're at the living area now where most of the guys live. Yeah. But of course they're in their houses. Now it's not actually that easy to see. You can actually climb that area. Yeah, the secret area behind or on the waterfall. Especially and that gives you a, um, a life artifact. So you definitely want to go there and get this. But we're here for something else. Because there's something else we can get in here. You there, you slept with my wife. Oh, sorry, I was wrong. Yeah, well, no, it's too late. I don't, I don't think you can actually enter one of these areas. Okay, where do you go now? You there, there's a fly on your shoulder. Hey, kill the fly. Wait a second, you died too. Ah, oh, sorry. I know, I know that we can go somewhere. Oh, look at that. I can use that as a weapon. Let's impale some stuff. <laughs> uh, come on. I know we can go somewhere, I think. I don't think that's a dead end. Wait a second. We haven't gone through that, didn't we? Yeah, that's the way to go on. Yeah, portal. Woo! Definitely wanted to get that. There we go. Seraphim Stronghold. So let's explore some more because we just kind of like stabbed into this place. We haven't really done anything except from getting that ha um, health artifact. So it's time to actually do some puzzles and stuff and advance deep into this place. Hey, you there. What is it? Oh, you want to die? Oh, I can grant you that wish. And I think you go back to the other area. Hey, you there. Stay. Well, he's dead. Uh, that would be the area, but I want to see if there's something else. I don't think that's all in here. There must be something else. Freeze, police! You moved. Don't move when the police says freeze. He learned his lesson. Well, I guess that's all. So, now let's actually go into the sewers. Because that's the thing to do. Or, I think there's another way than going to the sewers. But sooner or later we actually have to go to the sewers. Uh. Now there should be another way somewhere around here. Yeah, this way. Let's see where this takes us. A wooden door. What is that supposed to mean? Wait! Oh, she didn't wait. Ah. Oh. Wow, let's take a weapon. Yay! We can't go for that with a door, obviously. We can't pull stuff, we got something in our hands. Hmm, let's see if we can kill someone with that. Yay, we killed him. I mean, oh, we killed him. Whoa, this one has some lead dodging skills. But I guess it wasn't enough. 
Oh, some more elite dodging skills. Oh, wait, he's there. He's dead. Okay, let's jump down into the sewers, shall we? Well, this is the place we want to have um, swing power. I think we don't actually go have to go here yet. I think we have to actually drown the stuff first and then go here. Maybe. Yeah, we do. And also, there's a vampire there. I think he comes back to life when we uh, when we drain that stuff. I don't think we drain it in here. I think we drain it somewhere else. Yeah, I'm pretty sure about that. I think that's where it came from. Yeah, it was. 